What's up, YouTube? This is episode 70 of Through the Mail Autographs. We like to get autographs through the mail. We do baseball, football, basketball, wrestling, celebrities. We do everything. Golf, pretty much everything. We have a contest one to show you. We have an eBay purchase to show you. When you have... Uh, some TTMs to show you. Let's do the contest win first. This was a contest win from Eddie's baseball cards, I believe it was. Medium Runner, thanks for entering the journey giveaway and supporting the channel. Eddie at ba Eddie's baseball autographs. Cool. Got these autographs in his contest win. Sean Casey tops card. It's too new for me to know what year it is. Uh, 92 Upper Deck, Les Lancaster, Bob Scanlon, Fleur Ultra, Tops Gold, can't read the name, Gilbert Reyes, cool, thanks Eddie, appreciate it. If you haven't checked out his channel, he's got a cool channel, I'll put a link below, but cool, thanks for the cards. I don't, I don't think I had any of those, so. Let's do the TTMs. I was in a hurry this morning, so I didn't write how long they took. I can give you an idea. I can guess. I think this one took a couple weeks. Bernie Allen, 71 tops. 69 tops. 67 tops. And a 66 tops. And this one here was in one of those envelopes when they get damaged, and I don't know what happened to it, but the envelope was toast. But luckily... As you can tell, the cards didn't really get damaged. So, and all I do is put uh, an index card in there to help a little bit. See, I put like an index card, two of them. I usually write the letter on the index card. But I think this is a six for six. This is a 74, Al Herboski, 78. Uh, you guys saw me open up the those old timer cards I've been sending to a lot of the people out of that set. I like that set. It's cool. 76. Love my hostess cards. And another 74. Beautiful. Good stuff right there. And that Herboski took a couple weeks, I think. This probably put, took a couple weeks. Clyde Wright. TCMA. 76 tops. 73 tops. And a 72 tops. Nice. I like kind of like that 72 tops. It was Bill Plummer. This took a couple weeks. I bought a bunch of these 77s, so you'll see me get a bunch of those. I'm trying to put that set together too because I had a bunch of them. There's a 92 tops gold, Bill Plummer again. And then there's the regular one. There's another 77 because just because I had 1,800 of these, I'm just trying to get rid of a bunch of them. And a 74. I like that 74. That's a good looking card. And last TTM. One, two, three, four. We only got five TTMs today. That's unusual for me. Dave Duncan, 68 tops. Uh, 75 tops. 77 tops. And a 69 tops. And just to let you know... I did not write 175 letters yesterday. I took them to the mailbox today and I put stamps on them and it turned out to be 180 letters. And then I wrote three more this morning, so it's 183 letters I sent out this morning. So we'll get a lot back here in a couple weeks because uh, I haven't been getting very many back, you know, for me. And uh, I want to thank everybody that signed. I want to thank everybody that's watching. Let's thank Mr. Bernie Allen, Mr. Al Herboski, Mr. Clyde Wright, Mr. Bill Plummer, and Mr. Dave Duncan for signing my cards. They all turned out awesome. And I want to thank you guys for showing up and watching this. Like I said, the reason I do this is to help you guys because I don't have to make these videos. There's, there's no benefit for me to make these videos. I mean, I could sit here and get 500 requests a day. And it doesn't do anybody any good unless I let you guys know who's signing. Like I said... I like to let I like to let you guys know who's signing because like I said I've been doing TTM for off and on for over 30 years. I did it 25 years, then I took a hiatus, and then I came back. So like I said, I just want to let you guys know because I didn't have anybody to let me know back in the day. And this is all before computers and stuff. I had to write 
a hundred letters a day just to try to get anybody back. You know, we used to send out whole sets. I mean, like 700 cards in one day. Not one day, but one week. We'd do like a hundred a day for like every day till we got the set sent out. We'd usually buy like three sets and then send out all the particular, you know, same people to the, you know, three cards to each person, whoever had cards. And, uh, yeah, we didn't have a com you know computer to tell us exactly who signs. So like I'm just trying to help you guys out, man. Because like I said I've been I've been there. I've struggled. I've tried to you know figure out who signed and stuff. And I get all my addresses from Sports Card Forum. It's free. I don't pay any you know subscriptions or anything. Uh, I've only been doing this for 100 days. I have over 2,000 autographs that I've got through the mail in the past 100 days. So like I said, I think I've been trucking pretty good. I'm going to do a recap and show you guys some of the sets. Probably show you all the sets I'm working on because I'm working on every set from 1950 on up. But here's the eBay thing I got. I, I, I scour eBay all the time for autograph cards. This guy had, I don't have the other stuff with me. It was like some kind of promo sheet that was signed by two people. Uh, it was a Saints pennant signed by, I don't know, 50 some people or something. There's tons of people on it. I didn't even look at it. It's probably from the 90s or something like that. But I wanted it for these cards. These are all signed cards. And I got the signed pennant and the signed thing and all these signed cards. I think that I kind of counted them. I think there was either 90 or 100. I think it's 100, though. But I got 100 signed cards plus the other stuff. And I think I only paid, like, $25 shipped or something. I mean, something outrageous. I was going to check before I came on here, but... I forgot. It was only like 25, 30 bucks tops. And uh, I couldn't believe it. There's 100 cards. I think it wasn't very good description. It wasn't very good pictures. But I did see some st interesting stuff that I wanted. So I was like, yeah, I'll bid up to like 20, 30 bucks. So I think it might even be like 20 bucks. But here's what we got Vinny Buck, or Vince Buck, Vince Buck, Wesley Carroll, Wesley Carroll, Wesley Carroll checklist. Wesley Carroll. They're all saints, too. Wesley Carroll. There's a... What's his name? Toy Cook. Toy Cook. Another Cook. Von Dunbar. Uh, I don't know who that must be. Von Dunbar, too. I don't really care for the checklist too much. I'll probably end up putting those in lots myself just to get rid of them. There's Quinn Early. Quinn Early. Another Quinn Early. Another Quinn Early. Couple checklists. Uh, Kevin Haverdink. Haverdink. Yep, Haverdink. Never heard of him. There's another Kevin Haverdink. Uh, somebody. Joel Hilden Hildenberg. Another Joel. Another Joel. Another Joel. Hobie Brenner. I haven't heard of any of these guys. But you know what? I'm working on a bunch of these sets, so. Dalton Hilliard, I heard of him. He was good. Dalton Hilliard. Dalton Hilliard. Dalton Hilliard. I pretty much needed all these guys. I didn't have any of these guys. Another Dalton Hilliard. Dalton Hilliard. Dalton Hilliard. Don't know who that is. Don't know who that is. Sean Lumpkin. Sean Lumpkin. Sean Lumpkin. I guess this is signed on the back. Eric Martin. Uh, Wayne Martin. Brett Maxey. Brett Maxey. Fred McAfee. Alan Pinkett. Jeff Ullenhake. Was he an Ohio State guy? Yep, went to Ohio State. I thought he was. Frank Warren. Terrence Small. There's a reason I bought these. They're coming up, I think. Torrent Small. Torrent Small. I mean, I basically bought them because they were just a steal, but you'll find out why here in a minute. Ernest Spears. I'm not looking at the camera, so I'm hoping these are still in frame. Because I can't read them through the camera. John Face, or Tice, who's that? John Tice, wasn't he a, I think he was a coach, wasn't he? 
for the Vikings or something, maybe? Renardo Turnbull. That's one of the reasons I wanted it. He played at WVU. Renardo Turnbull. Actually, I was at a game, and Major Harris was the quarter, you know, quarterback for uh, Turnbull's team. They were national champions. Not national champions. They went to the national championship game. They lost in the third, round, third quarter. Or third play of the game, Major Harris got hurt. And uh, Notre Dame ended up winning. But I'm at the game with uh, Major Harris and Reggie Rembert, who was their star receiver. I'm sitting in between those two guys chatting. And uh, Renardo Turnbull was there. The whole team was there. And I got I got Renardo's autograph then. But he was one of my favorite players. There he is in his WVU uniform. I got several of him. He doesn't do TTM either, I don't think. I've never been able to get him. And there was a ton of Renardo Turnbulls in here I wanted. I haven't had any of his autographs. Well, at the event, I got some team balls signed. But I didn't have any cards at the time. There's Floyd Turner, Pat Swilling. I met him at the College Football Hall of Fame. Uh, I went up for Major Harris's induction. And uh, actually, you know, I was invited by Major to come up and hang out with him. There's uh, Vaughn Johnson. Vaughn Johnson. There's some more stuff in here, too, I wanted it for. Vaughn Johnson. Vaughn Johnson. Vaughn Johnson. Jim Everett. There's one buddy I know. Jim Everett. Gene Atkins. Joe Johnson. There you go. Morton Anderson. I don't know if he is a Hall of Famer. If he's not, he should be. I haven't paid attention to the Hall of Fame in about 20 years, so. Gene Atkins. Another Morton Anderson. 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 Hobie Brenner. Hobie Brenner. Hobie Brenner. Reuben Mays. That's a nice one. Another Hobie Brenner. Another Hobie Brenner. Got a ton of that dude. I never heard of him. Hobie Brenner. But I don't have any of these, and I'm working on almost all these sets. Stan Brock. Stan Brock. Mike Buck. Who's this? Floyd Turner. Uh, there's somebody behind that. You can't read that. Richard Cooper. Joe Johnson. Joe Johnson. Vaughn Dunbar again. Vaughn Dunbar again. Irv Smith. He's kind of got a crappy autograph. Just looks like it says Tim. Wayne Martin. Wayne Martin. Ed King. And who's that? Derek Brown or something? Yeah, Derek Brown. So there was a hundred autograph cards. And what was there, like 10 Morton Anderson autographs or something? There was just a ton of them. You know, he's a Hall of Famer, and I think he charges 10 or $15 through the mail now. Uh, maybe even 20 I can't remember. But uh, I saw all those Morton Andersons. I was like, man, i got to buy this. If, it, if this thing goes under 50 bucks, I'm going to buy this lot because, you know, it was worth it just for the Morton Andersons. So uh, that was a very, very good lot for me. I was very happy to get that. Like I said, it was somewhere between 20 and 30 bucks. It wasn't more than 30 and it wasn't under 20. It was either 20 or 25. And like I said, I also have a Saints like pennant that's signed by like you can't you couldn't put another signature on it. It's just filled up. So, what do you guys think? You think that was a good buy? What was your favorite card today? Uh my favorite card today is probably man, I don't know. I got some i tell you the truth, I like four out of the five, really like. I like the Bill Plummer, I like the Dave Duncan, I like the Herboski, and I like the Bernie Allen. But I can only pick one. I'm going to go with that Dave Duncan. That's just cool. 69 tops. Signed really nice. I always love the catchers and their catchers, their pose or whatever. I always like those for some reason. I don't know why. But uh, tell me what you guys think. Please uh, like subscribe if you subscribe please hit all that way you can see all my videos have a good one guys peace